All right, we're gonna be making motherfucking cookies. Um, now it's supposed to be Christmas cookies. So here's the thing. I went to the store and they didn't have no Christmas cookies. They had regular cookies type. So we're gonna make some chocolate chip cookies. All right, we're gonna start with uh, motherfucking spaghetti. So because I ain't got um Christmas cookies, we got some Toll House type. Um, we're gonna make some Toll House cookies. I don't want all twelve, so I'm not gonna make all twelve. There's twelve big cookies. Uh, yeah. So preheat the oven to three fifty. Okay. All right. All right, it's preheat. Then, my fucking flat pan. Oh, sorry. Okay. So I got a regular flat pan. So this gonna have to do some little bit of num num num. All right, so look, chat. Aluminum ripping a little bit. That's fine. I have your aluminum. See, I usually get name brand. My mama don't care about the name brand as long as it's aluminum. So it's ripping a little bit. But we got some aluminum. I'll put it on the pan type shit. Uh, I'll put it here. Flip it over on this side because it's a little extra long and it rips. Boom. Merry crema. You know? Alright, so we got us a, you know what I'm saying? A, uh, a flat with a motherfucking with aluminum on it. Okay, now we need, what is spray it? Hey, look, so the cookies don't stick, zero calories. Get yourself some of this. Not too much though, because the cookies don't taste crazy. Just a little spritz, just a little spritz, you know what I'm saying? Like a little, little, little tight shit. Bow, now your cookies is not sticking, you feel me? Now your cookies is not sticking. Now that we done that, we about to touch raw cookies. So let's wash our hands, chat. Be sure you always wash your fingers. You go, why are you, you're like on the mat, sir. Your hair still hasn't grown back from when you got surgery. Are you going bald? He don't know nothing. He's just happy to be here. All right, so let's wash our hands. What did Maja say? Them hoes sticking. Maja, that's some hater shit you're saying right now. So let's, let's, let's get the wash in our hands. There ain't nothing incriminating back there, is it? Nah, it's not. Okay. Nothing. Right? No, nothing incriminating. Okay. All right. Finger tippies. Wait till it get warm. Uh, uh, uh. Use parchment paper. You don't have to worry about sticking. I ain't got parchment paper right now. I'm making do with what I got, bro. Damn, this water kind of cold. Yeah. 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 Okay. Damn. Damn, water. Come on, man. Okay, there we go. There's the warm water. Chad, if I was to spray you, what would you do? Nothing. I ain't nothing but some baby bag bitches. Okay, wet the things up. A little bit of Dawn. Dawn Perignon type shit. Wow. Get yourself a lather. Nice little lather going. In between them finger lingers. You know what I'm saying? A little work that jaw. Type shit. Ugh. Wash your wrist a little bit. Cause you, you know what I'm saying? Not too much. Not too crazy. Make sure you, you know, a little bit of. Side swipe, get the soap under the nails, a little bit of water, new lather, new lather. The lather is not dry. You know when the lather be dry and shit. You know what I'm talking about? You know what I'm talking about? That's shit. And then you get the rinsing. Wow. There's some fingernails. Wow. Okay, this is hot a little bit. Dang. Ow.
bow, bow. Get the water off, you know what I'm saying? Get as much water off as possible. Boom. Paper Teasley. You feel me? Type shit. Now you got clean grippers. Now we're going to take you back over here. <clears throat> okay. Now that we got the clean grippers. The oven's still preheating. So, let's talk. Treat me like that towel. She scrubbed the webs of her finger, of her hands or her fingernails. I said get in the betweens. Don't fuck with dog, you know what I'm saying? Stop playing with me. <clears throat> you just mad because you got big callous hands. Are you recording? Yeah, 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 yeah. Type shit. He's about to be burnt as fuck. Bro, the cookie's not even in the oven yet. The oven is preheating. Now, I do have to keep this oven is new. So, like, when the oven is new and shit like that, when the oven is new, they get to, like, it get to, like, fucking cooking too fast and shit. So, you do got to keep an eye on it. You got to keep a little eye on it. Man, whose balls is dropping? The New Year balls, man. I don't do nothing but touch a keyboard. What'd you do before me, Majin? You know what I'm saying? Them grippers wasn't always grippers, bro. Them was man hands. And you know what I'm saying? I know you gotta you had to put some food on the table for the family now. Tight shit, so. Simba really had to make a tutorial on how to wash hands because she, she don't remember. If I didn't remember, how would I wash my hands? If I didn't remember when I have to look it up, I wouldn't be making the tutorial. Because I know. Y'all don't know. Y'all don't even know how to touch grass, let alone wash your hands after. Tight shit. <sighs> anyway, now we got the Toll House tight shit. Makes 12 big cookies. So we're gonna slide these drawings out. Tight shit. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. You know what I'm saying? So we're gonna make. Chad, it's just me. I'm only making three. I said I was gonna make six. I'm only gonna make three cookies. It's just me. I'm not about to have all these cookies. You know? Alright, so. Oh, shit. Damn. Am I that bad? Am I that bad? Or did they not just... Okay, so. Ripping off one, some pieces came off. My trash? I'm gonna take these pieces and stick them to the, the cookie. Maybe. Maybe I can save it. Think that? Think I can save it? Then he's saying yes. You make the cookies then, bitch! I'm sorry. I don't mean to curse at y'all. <sighs> y'all just... Y'all get me there. Y'all bring me there and I don't like being so negative. Okay. Another cookie. It broke. It, at this point, it's Toll House. It's not me. At this point, it's Toll House. It's not me. Last but not least... Lastly, last big cookie. Perfect rip. Can't make this up. This is the rip of the other one, so like, shut up. But like, perfect rip. It's a... You know what I'm saying? Can't... Can't get that nowhere else. Tight shit, so. Got some cookies left. I'm not sharing. She blaming us for her temper. Imagine, I can personally blame you for my temper. Alright. Now we got cookies. The oven is not preheated yet. God damn. The oven is preheated. Alright, let's go eat Damn! It's hot. All right, set a timer for 10 minutes. A Timizy, a little teasy, a little Timizy. 10 of them Johns. You got no game. I need y'all to understand, like, nigga said I have no game. Nigga, how? I've achieved something that most people will never achieve in their lifetime. I've been in multiple, multiple 
long relationships, okay? I was married, okay? Most people are not going to find someone they want to marry. I was married at one point. If you, you got to have some type of game or something. If you get married, nigga, if you got somebody that wanted to spend their life with you at one point, you want a cookie or something? I, you were actually married? I thought that was an inside joke. No, nigga. I was married for three fucking years and in a relationship with that person three years prior to that. I was in a relationship for six fucking years. I don't believe in marriage without, at least without a prenup. I don't think I would ever get married again. But like, you know. Can you recap your marriage story for us? It's not a recap. Marriage story? I, there's nothing to there's nothing to tell. Niggas just Ted, I'm gonna be honest. I would say one of the main reasons why my relationship didn't work is because I was too invested in the YouTube. I put a lot of shit to the side for this. That's that's literally one of the reasons why my fucking my my uh my relationship didn't work. I had I was too focused on uh Oh, look at pinned. I can't see the pin because I'm on my iPad. You up now? Yeah, you know. Shit happens, you know. Was sad at the time, not sad no more. Hey, you know, I got what I wanted. That's what happens, chat. Like when you, when you chase your dreams, you're gonna lose stuff along the way. It sucks, but you are. Unfortunately, I lost a marriage. That's what it. You know. Do I regret it? Oh, ah, uh, mm, like I ain't gonna lie, this some this being able to stream and do YouTube is like some of the greatest shit that ever happened to me. But could I have been there for that person more? Yes, 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 I could have. Um, like right before I started YouTube, um, they lost one of their like grandparents and stuff but like and I was trying to be there but I've never experienced loss like that so I didn't know how to be there for that person and also like they were just in a weird they never had that kind of grief either and then like I wasn't in the best spot in my life so did she take half your shit? Nah Nah she didn't take half my stuff you know what? What's crazy is the courts tried to get her to take half my bread. The one, the year we like officially did the divorce, um, the year we officially did the divorce, I had made a hundred thousand dollars in a year, so I did very good for myself. That was you. That was like the most I've ever made, and with making a hundred thousand dollars in a year, I think she she made like like 40 or something she was in the military so you know we agreed though like i because i didn't start making that type of money until we weren't together no more we we were we were separated we weren't together and then youtube started working and then like when we was filling out the papers i had you know you have to put down how much money you made and shit like that but she was like i don't you know let's just get it over with i don't want anything of yours you know what i'm saying i know you this is what you wanted, blah, blah, blah. I was like, okay, cool. I don't need anything either. We we were in agreement that, like, yeah. You know, it's... You know, that's still my dog to this day. Like, we don't talk as often because I, I try to separate myself from the situation. You gotta, like... You gotta, like, separate yourself so you can make sure you don't, like... Not even get hurt, but just, like, fall back into that... Those feelings and stuff like that. Do y'all still talk as friends? I mean... We're not, like... The best of friends. But like. I, we were cool for two years before we even started dating. That was Simba's Illuminati ritual. She had to get the. Right. I had to sell my marriage for a fucking. <laughs> for YouTube success. Spousal support thing. Oh yeah yeah yeah. So they was like. You know I made a hundred thousand. We was already in agreements. Like we don't want anything from each other. It is what it is. We just separating. 
you know. So when we went to the court, you know, we had all the papers on. We just had to go in front of a judge. And the judge was like, I see you made a substantial amount of money. We're not doing spousal support. I was like, no. He's like, can I ask why? Because we agreed. We agreed. Why? you? We already signed the papers. Mind your business. I was like, oh, we agreed. She was like, yeah, we're not doing spousal support. He's like, okay. All right, granted, da 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 da, and then we was, it was just saying today. Nigga was trying to like I'm like bro, she good, I'm good. Mind your business. Okay, that was a timer. Let me see, let me see. Okay, for sure needs a couple more minutes. Let's do two more minutes. Let's do two more minutes. But yeah, um. Judge makes a commission on that's what I, that's how he was acting like he was make, making commission or something, but um, yeah, that's still like, like I said, we was friends for two years before we even started dating or started talking, so I'm never gonna like, I don't, I don't have hate in my heart for nobody. Um, you know what I'm saying? I, I, I in all my situationships or relationships, I was done dirty, so like. I there's there, I could hold hate in my heart, but I don't. It is what it is. I forgive everybody. Because at the end of the day, I'm living the life I want to live now. So who am I to hate you when I'm just doing great, you know? That's why you need to try men for real. Hell no. Nah. Hell no. Nah. Forgive and forget, you know? It is. It is what it is. We grew apart. Like there's, like there's for sure. Like, am I upset about it? About some of the things that transpired? Yeah, because you know what I'm saying you know how you do those promises in the beginning. Like, yo, don't you know what I'm saying? Because since we were friends for two years prior to, we helped each other through breakups. Like it was like, all right, just you know what I'm saying. Don't ever do this. Just if you feel like you're done, just let me know. You know what I'm saying? Type shit. So. Couple promises were broken, and that's probably what hurt the most. Is like just be honest with me. But other than that, it was it wasn't nothing like nothing done. But it was like it was something done, if that makes sense. It was nothing physical, but it was it was more of a mental thing. So, still back there slurping that boy be thirsty, man. I be got him to fill up his water jug, like every uh, you know what I'm saying. If you found someone who was so Damn, that was two minutes already? Let me just turn the light on instead of opening this moment. Damn, the cookie's still already. Alright, I'm gonna give it two more minutes. Jesus. Would I uh if you found someone who was supporting of the YouTube, would you get in a relationship again? Um, yeah. Yeah, I would. I think I would. If you weren't doing YouTube or streaming right now, what would you be doing? I'd probably be like working in some warehouse, what I was doing before. Because I'm like, I'm a, I'm forklift certified. So I can drive all types of forklifts and shit like that. So if, if need be, I can go back to a warehouse and make some money. But I'm not going back. You would be at McDonald's. You got me fucked up. You think I'll ever work fast food again? But yeah, I'm forklift certified. Any advice for dating someone who works a lot? Um. Any advice for dating someone? Like, are you the person that works a lot? Or are you dating somebody that works a lot? What about security? Nah, I had. I've done security. Like my security jobs weren't bad, but I'm good off it. Visit them at work. I do? Okay, so you work a lot. Um, I'm going to be honest. I can't. I really can't give you any advice. Because at the end of the day, like, I've known, I, I know there's been times where I'm not doing right by the person I'm talking to because I just work so fucking much. I'm so dedicated to this shit that I give up quality time. I give up quality time with the fam. I give up quality time with, like, 
the homies, unless it's like work related, I don't really do shit but work. So I, I can't give you advice because I don't know. You just got to find someone that's willing to. I knew that shit was coming. I saw it. You just got to find somebody that's willing to stick with you. You know? Let's see, let's see. Ugh. I think they I'm gonna give it one more minute. I'm gonna give it one more minute. Cause it looks like done on the outside, but like soft in the middle. We the most consistent for real. <laughs> if we talking consistent with like editing, Majin is very consistent. He be doing shit last minute as fuck. He be doing shit last minute as fuck, but you know. But uh, yeah, chat. This is that's it's 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 like I was saying though. No, it it's the uh the downside of chasing your dreams, bro. You chase your dreams, you're gonna lose some things along the way. Some things are gonna have to suffer, su suffer, suffer. Some things are gonna have to suffer, like. I'll say chasing that in the beginning stages cost me a marriage. Chasing it currently, well, chasing it previous to, chasing it prior to that, like, like 2020 to 2021, my weight took a toll. I was, I was so locked in that I wasn't focusing on fitness and that shit hurt me in the end and I gained more weight than I would like to. So like when you when you're locked in chat, some certain things take a toll. It takes certain things take like a hit they get the back burner and you don't really care about it until it's too late. And it's unfortunate but it's it's what happens bro. I this last this one right here, it might be the chocolate chip. I think, I think these are done. I'm gonna bring y'all over. I'm gonna bring y'all over. So like, they look good, but this one right here, the middle don't look all the way done. But like these two look done. So I'm gonna just, I'm gonna let it chill. And I'm gonna see. Watch how hard it is to peel them bitches off. Why you on my dick? Where? But yeah, chat. If you're willing to, if you're willing to let certain things, certain things in your life take the back burner and chase your dreams for, for a year, it'll make a major difference. I promise you. I promise you. They, it, it'll make a difference, but you know, certain things you will take the back burner. Making medium rare cookies is crazy. Imagine. Why are you on my dick? Why? All right, let's see what these cookies talk about. All right. Oh, it cooked itself. Type shit. It cooked itself. All right, where is the motherfucking spaghetti? Look at that. Them cookies not coming off the pan. Them cookies not coming off the pan. Watch it come off the pan, bitch. Look, look, look out. Yeah, Majin, get off my dick, boy. Look out. Look how easy. Little dick eater. The cookie, cookie's not coming off. Look! Dick eater. It's sticking. Yeah, you sticking my nuts right on your chin. Thick man. Alright, let's put these. Let's put these cookies. Ooh, we got a little burnt at the bottom. I should have took them out sooner. It's not like burnt crazy, but it's brown. A little brown at the bottom. Let me see. Oh, it's also. Awesome. It's a brown. The bottom is crunchy. A little? Yeah, nigga, a little, bro. Relax, bro. It's the one cookie, nigga. Get off dick. Golly, it's the number one dick eater.
That's why y'all not getting them. Look, look. Y'all not getting them. Nope, it's Majin's fault. Y'all not getting them. Just some milk, yo ass. First of all, who drinks milk, nigga? Weirdo. I know your booty hole be leaking. And that was cookies and story time with Shipping the God. I'm going back to my setup. Fuck you. Fuck you, niggas. And I'm leaving y'all out here.